Hello, and welcome back to Let's Play Stardew Valley. This is your host, River Foxen, and it is Monday, the 22nd of spring. As usual, we're going to check the weather report. All right, and partially cloudy, so that means no rain. That's really all that matters with the uh, weather report, whether or not there's rain. All right, and the uh, fortune says spirits are in good humor today. And living off the land. Get your hands on a fishing pole and sell your catch. Yep, we know how to fish. All right, let's head outside. Now yeah, it looks like we can uh, pick some... Uh, what are these parsnips? I keep wanting to call them radishes, but they're parsnips. to work. All right, so we're gonna buy seeds today, but we only have, uh, what, six days left in the month, I think, so... Oop. Keep water in the same spot. Um, so we're going to see if I can even start to grow some parsnips. Um, because we're going to make sure that uh, we have time for them to uh, be harvested. Alright. Let's grab that. Start another one, but then let's uh, go here. Drop these guys off. Yeah, let's see here. Actually, we want to pick up our bars. I'm going to see about upgrading our axe today. Let's drop off these. but I have to wait. All right. Let's uh, see here. Parsnip seeds, four days. So yeah, we can uh, buy those. All right. Let's go see about upgrading our axe. I also have a geode that I need to have cracked open. Prehistoric rib. Well, I can drop that off at the museum. But let's open up the geode first. It might have something else we can drop off at the museum. Alright. Let's process this geode. Nope. Coal. Alright. Upgrade. I want a copper axe. So five copper bars, of course. All right, so basically it won't be ready tomorrow. It'll be ready the day after. So that's why a watering can, you have to make sure you do it like when the next day is going to rain so that you don't need your watering can. All right, hey there, Gunther. Let's see here. Got a prehistoric rib. Let's put it over here with these bone things. Alright. And while we're out here, we're gonna check for some forage. Mm, it's, you can tell it's a 
getting to the end of spring because the cherry blossom petals are falling. Fish. I just wanted to see if that was something. Just wanted to make sure it wasn't something I. It's because it is an artifact, but it looks like I have already turned one into Gunther. Which means there's really nothing for it other than the salad. I've generally found that artifacts don't actually make great gifts. Um, I mean, you could give them. I don't think there's people who will not, like they'll actively dislike it, but uh, people generally, it's, it's not anyone's favorite gift. So we're doing forage today. We're probably going to do forage on the last day of spring as well, because that'll be our last chance to get spring forage. Obviously, because um, after that, it just automatically switches to summer and it'll be all new things. It'd be nice to get to a new season. start taking down some of these. I think I can take down the these guys. These ones I think I need to be level three with my axe for. And then with stones, I think that you don't get a benefit until you're level three. You can break these big stones at level three, but level two doesn't give you that much of a benefit. Maybe some um, stamina loss reduction, but I'm not 100% sure on that one. Let's actually grab uh, these guys because we will start some, uh, just keep the copper going because uh, I'm at a point where I kind of want to be upgrading my tools as soon as I can. Really, I want to upgrade the watering can um, early this season. Um, basically, what it'll allow you to do, the level 2 watering can will allow you to do like three at once. And I think there is a stamina loss reduction. I wasn't sure if I grabbed that one, so I'll just hit it again. Um, I don't know that you actually need to water your cat. I think if you don't like 
give the cat attention every day. He actually, the heart goes away for a while. He gets like a little pissy at you. All right, let's uh, drop off our forage. If I should do some more forage, I might as well. It's not like I'm low on energy. I'm just gonna do a little north circuit. There's a whole lot here. Yep, not a whole lot. There's a flower over here. What I could do is do some some uh, chores. Um, I can do some just clearing up. Just until it gets dark or I run out of energy, whichever happens first. dense over here. But basically, yeah, I like to clear up everything on the field as much as I can and then um, just to use those resources. in my inventory because I'll probably want to use them tomorrow. But anyway, I think we're going to call it a night. So if you enjoyed this Let's Play, be sure to like and subscribe and click the bell icon if you're so inclined. And I'll see you later.